Hey, what is going on guys? My name is Josh Keatley and today I want to show you the best spots to put your IMS and your sentry gun on every single map. Now a really good spot on Tremor is just setting the IMS down right there in the middle and that way when anybody comes up those stairs they're going to immediately get hit by an IMS or if anyone comes through the door you know up those stairs and through that door they're going to also get hit by an IMS. Now the best spot for your sentry gun is in the next room over facing so that it can hit the stairs if anyone comes up those stairs or if anyone tries to go through that door and sneak past your IMS it'll get them also. Now with this IMS sentry gun combo there's absolutely no way that anybody can get anywhere close to you so I like to sit right here and people can come in the window watch out for that and help shoot anyone that is trying to come up the stairs but normally your sentry gun is just going to take care of them and just kind of camp it out right here until you can get your next kill streak and I just go with the helicopter works really well on this map and this is a great IMS sentry gun combo one of the best on all the maps now I'm gonna go ahead and show you this on a different map we're gonna take a look at prison break now it does work great on free-for-all team deathmatch kill confirmed any type of map obviously it's not gonna work good on search and destroy domination haunted you know stuff like that but for the regular game modes this works great now on prison break you're gonna want to go up in the tower make sure no one's up there first and put your IMS on the stairs and sometimes it doesn't want to go down you just gotta move it around we'll go around till you get it there and then put your sentry gun right there on the corner so it's overlooking everything and that is a hands down the best spot that sentry gun is gonna get you a lot of kills and if you do have any IEDs throw them by the ladder and you can always hear them coming up the ladder uh, you know even if they do have dead silence you know it's very easy to hear people going up that ladder so you're just gonna be watching that hill make sure no one snipes you from the hill and you're gonna be listening for people coming up that ladder now on the map Octane a real good spot to hold down is the broken wall building and you're going to want to take your IMS and put that at the bottom of the staircase. Now once again you do have a little bit of trouble putting it down but you just got to wiggle it around move it around and it will go there. And then you're going to go ahead and put your sentry gun right at the edge of the building and that is just going to shoot away at the entire map. And if you do have an IED throw that down by the ladder and you know you can hear that ladder once again really well so if anyone is coming up the ladder you easily hear it and you can shoot them or your IED will kill them and a real good spot to look is over there at the hotel people are constantly on that top floor of the hotel so you can just watch out for them and you can constantly listen for that ladder and kill anyone that is by the ladder now I'm gonna be showing you two different locations on freight and the first location I like is in this building right up the stairs and as soon as they come up the stairs they're gonna get hit with an IMS and then I'm gonna come right up here where a lot of people hide for infected and I'm gonna put my sentry gun out just facing the entire map and that sentry gun will go ham up there and the only thing you have to watch out for them is coming up here so I'm gonna go ahead and shut that gate to make that easier and you know they can open that from the outside but if they do open it I hear them and I easily shoot them so now you just gotta watch them coming through that door and coming up that stairs now the other location that I'm gonna show you is down in the tunnel and you're gonna go ahead and put your IMS right there next to the steps so when they come down those stairs they're gonna get IMS and then put your sentry gun facing that other doorway when they come down those stairs they're gonna be screwed and this is a really hardcore camping area but you know this works real good on free for all and one negative thing about this is sometimes you know you don't get enough attention sometimes you know if you're not getting enough action down there just shoot your gun you know without a silencer and people will come down there and you will get some action 
Now you can even bring your sentry gun right there to the top of the stairs and throw an IED down there in case your IMS does give out back there. Now the downside of this is they can come to the right of the sentry gun and shoot it so you do have to kind of watch out for that and just be able to shoot them before they shoot your sentry gun. Now on whiteout the best location is inside the tunnel that's over closest to the buildings and you go ahead and you set your IMS down right in the middle and then when you get your sentry gun you're gonna go ahead and put that facing towards the sawmill down from the hill a little bit so the only way they can shoot the sentry gun is kind of go to the top of the hill and shoot down at it or they can shoot from the right side but you're gonna keep your eye on that sentry gun watch for people coming to the right side or behind it and you're not gonna get too close to your IMS because that will get you killed so stay kind of in between the two where you're not out in the open and you're not too close to your IMS. Now on Warhawk you want to go above the bakery and put your IMS right there by the door and then you're gonna put your sentry gun facing out of the window and this is a really good combo right here there's absolutely no way anybody can get in the building and this can help you get your other kill streaks extremely easy. Now another really good room to hold down is go up top of the middle room that's over by the truck. Put your IMS right next to the door and that's going to take care of anyone trying to get through the door. Then you're going to put your sentry gun inside the building facing outside of the window. Then you just kind of stay put right here and just let your kill streaks rack up. It's a really great spot, very effective. On the map Sovereign, you're going to go to this back hallway here and you're going to put your IMS right up against the wall so when they come around the corner, they're not going to expect it. They're going to get IMS and then you're going to go to this other side and you're going to set your sentry gun up right here and that's going to cover that entire part of the map right there. They can't get you through the door. You're going to keep looking out that window. That's the only way they can get your sentry gun. Your IMS protects you back there and they're going to constantly try to shoot your sentry gun but you're going to keep an eye on that window right there and get any kills that you can right there through that window and protect the back side of your sentry gun. Now on the map strike zone, you're going to want to put your IMS right there in the hallway and put it right in the middle. That way, no matter what door they go through, it will get them killed. And then you're going to put your sentry gun right here behind the bar facing the big doors. And then the only location you have to watch is those back doors now. And the IMS going to take care of them in the kitchen, the sentry gun, the other doors. So just keep your focus on these back doors. And when your IMS does blow up, remember to keep an eye on that door also. That sentry gun is going to last usually a lot longer than that IMS does. Now on the map Chasm, a real good spot is right in the middle. Go ahead and put your IMS right before they come out of that hallway. And then you're going to go ahead and put your sentry gun down facing so when they come up the ladder they'll get shot. When they come out the big door they'll be shot. Or when they come around the door or around that hallway they're going to get IMS or sentry gun. And if you have an IED set that by that back door and really watch that back door area. And right here you can really listen to them come in any direction. You see my IED help me get that kill right there. And this is a real good strategy, high traffic area that you can easily hold down with the IMS and sentry gun combo. Now on the map flooded, you want to put your IMS in this back hallway and put it kind of close to the wall so they can't go around the corner and shoot. And then when you do get your sentry gun, come to this other door and face it right in front of that door. That way your IMS is blocking the one door, the hallway, and your sentry gun is facing the other door. Now on the map over Overlord, you want to go to the middle room and put your IMS right over here so when they come up the stairway and out that door it will get them and then when you do get your sentry gun you want to put that in the corner facing the stairway and the door and it'll get that left door then you can hide over here and easily help your IMS your sentry gun right there and every once in a while look up at the window to your left in case someone is trying to shoot your sentry gun from there or they're trying to shoot you so keep an eye on that area also. Now on the map Stonehaven you're going to want to go to the middle room and put your IMS right there next to that wall that way when they do come in this room they're going to immediately get IMS 
Then you're going to put your sentry gun facing that direction in between the building and that big dirt hill. Now you're just going to watch that area over by the castle. And this way you can have a good chunk of the entire map covered. And it's a really great strategy. Now on the map siege, you want to go to the room that's right outside the tunnel. The one that everyone likes to camp in. And you're going to go ahead and put your IMS right up top of the stairs that way when they come through the door or up the stairs they're going to get IMS you see I about got died from IMS there then you want to put your sentry gun facing those other stairs and out that little peak hole in case they try to shoot your sentry gun there now you're really going to focus on watching that window and just helping your IMS out or your sentry gun out you know without dying to help you get your other kill streaks now on the map storm front you're going to want to go to that very back room and put your IMS on that staircase right there. And then you're going to go ahead and put your sentry gun down on the second platform. The reason I go with the second platform, that way it can see outside better and it can see the people coming in the door. And this is a really good spot. Now all you have to do is just wait around and... You check out that window every once in a while and just wait until you get your other kill streaks. A great spot. It took me a really long time to make this video. I really hope that you guys do like it. Please support it with likes and comments. I want to thank you guys so much for watching my video today. And you guys have a great day today. Did you know? Get right there in your crotch. Uh, oh yeah, uh, eat that uh, shit, uh, dog. Let me in on that. Watch your side, watch your side. <laughs> Oh. And you guys are so weird. You guys are like kangaroos in a kangaroo parlor. <laughs>